This video will depart a little bit from our usual style because it's a very special weekend. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be popping the big question to Elena after over six years being together. And what's even more important is, not only is that gonna be a surprise, but we have a big surprise party planned right in this spot behind us. Her friends are in on the surprise. They're gonna be meeting us tonight at the property to camp and that will give our family time to set up the party while we're gone and come make it a surprise tomorrow afternoon. So stay tuned. Tonight is a special night because we have never camped here before. I mean, I actually spent the night in the truck once, but we won't talk about that. Uh, but tonight, our couple friends are meeting us out here. We're gonna actually have a campfire, a tent, little sleepover, and yeah. we're actually gonna have some fun here for once. Where <laughs> And we're we not actually working. Yeah, we can actually take a break from the work. I'll get a little bit of work done here and there, but this weekend is about having some fun and reuniting with our friends who just recently moved from Michigan to Pennsylvania and did kind of a big career change and everything to do that. And so this is our first time seeing them in a few years, I think, Yeah, right? yep. So it'll be fun to hang out with them and enjoy some s'mores by the campfire. Yep, so let's get our tent set up and get a fire ring going. Yeah. Elena's trying to decide on the best tent location. I learned something about Elena tonight on the way here that I never knew. In her adult life, she has never slept in a tent. This is gonna be her first tenting experience in, uh, I mean, I guess as a kid you did it, what, maybe like 15 years ago? Oh, well, it was probably longer than that. Longer than 15 years ago. So this is awesome. We have two firsts tonight. First, tent sleeping experience of Elena's adult life and our, her first night camping at our property in, oh, what is it, two years of ownership? Two plus years of ownership? <laughs> this tent. All right, you're gonna have to give a review of this tent. This is an REI half dome backpacking tent and I will say it is fantastic. Sometimes So it, easy to set up. It pays to pay for quality. How much did you pay for this? I think it was like 300 or 200. And relatively speaking, for how often people camp, it's a pretty good investment. It is. I definitely know right. it wasn't more this than This is like my favorite thing about it, is there's no figuring out where any of this stuff goes. These are all linked together. You just have to basically slide them in where the string is pulling them to. So there's no secret. And then just lay it on top. Oh, that's really cool. These are nice and light too. Super light. So what do we do? Just stick each corner in their respective little grommet. Oh, and try not to de decapitate me in the process. Wow, that's okay. so easy. And then all you gotta do is hook everything onto this, and then you're done. And you put these grommets over the ends, and then there's a rain fly on top if we want that. But it's not supposed to rain tonight, so. I'd say we just go under the stars. Sleep Until under the stars. A Until a bear deer comes. comes. Deer or bear? Do, do, bears, bears aren't around. Mm, there are no bears. <laughs> Boom. Wow, that's so quick. Time to add the sleeping members. Uh-oh, we got some stink bugs in there. Take mine out. Self-inflating. I'm supposed to keep it not rolled in storage, so. Oh, I really? I do have to, uh, yeah, because it's like a shape memory thing, so. I think they're here. Oh man. There they are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. Beauty of an F-150. <laughs> Look at that thing. Oh my gosh, he's, he's, uh, he's partying. <laughs> Hello. Howdy, howdy. Made it. You made it all the way from Michigan. Bring it in, brother. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Hi, how Rachel. Are you? This is going to be a long burning. Oh, yeah. We're well, we got all night. all night. We got a lot to catch up on. Yeah. I know. So is the strategy to dry them out first, or dry them out with the fire that we're going to make inside of it? You just, I don't know. There's no strategy. It's just like we'll a, this is the way you do it, and 
Oh, you just pour the coals in there? Aaron's got this. I have Aaron full faith the in the fire master. master. Great, what are you I usually see them, they're like this big. Whoa. Like double? Oh, yeah. yeah. Big things, but, uh, right? But so many little so things they just didn't take care of. Sure. You're on sugar strike. <laughs> yeah, so for the most part, uh, it's uh, <laughs> I've never heard that term. <laughs> oh, I, I got lots of terms. <laughs> Medically exempt from I just don't like to work that oh, much. Really? So, hold it. And it was like, for Aaron's whole week, it was like, $30. Yeah, she, she was away. I was like, what did you live on all week? He said milk $30. and bananas. Bananas are delicious. I'm going to get this I don't even know how they sell them for as cheap as they can. I don't get that. Get them here. Like, I know. They're coming from the freaking Caribbean. Or some, I don't know yeah, where some, some, That boy got some heat. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mountain pie pizza. I love it. Grill master, the fire master, and the grill master. Just a piece of scrap plywood. Wow. Going to explode. Thing is going to just <laughs> mushrooms obliterate. Oh my gosh, you can already smell the mushrooms. Yeah. Now that is a mountain pie if I ever saw one. Look at that. I remember you saying that a couple months ago. She's just, she's just still 21. And like... First tent night of your adult life, how did it go? Awful. <laughs> I couldn't sleep. I got I heard all the noises and it really freaked me out. So lots of animals coming to get you in the night. <laughs> My anxiety was like at an eleven. So yikes. Yeah, I ended up having to go into the truck. We had a truck sleeper last night. <laughs> it worked. Rachel, how about you? Never better. <laughs> Never better. Aaron, morning up report. The wrong here, brother. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Like. Yeah, must just be so I took a picture when I went to go pee. You could Mm-hmm. That's some dense fog. Cleaning the eggs with hand sanitizer. Didn't bring anything there. And forgot coffee pot. Aaron has sacrificed his water bottle. Water bottle boiled coffee. Ten out of Nothing ten. Nothing better. Okay, keep it simple. That okay, we'll we'll, yeah, we'll, yeah, we're gonna Even though they're yeah. like these tiny little beasts. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, yeah. I'll do this one better. Gentle. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Yeah, this um, rooster's gotta go. Yeah, like a lot of people. You're gonna are become like, a meal. <laughs> exactly. And so it's kind of weird because some. Like this would be facing this way, right? Alright. And then this would be facing this way. Good enough for government work, as they say. Got the chalk yeah. line strung across. That is how we will do our stud measurement on this uneven so concrete slab. If this one's near. So both our bottom plate and top plate are tacked in. And then honestly, just a little little bit of a rub. Okay, yeah, that works a little good. bit better. Okay, let's see how you do that. So yep, and then you might want to take the square and transfer that so you have a good cut line. Yeah. Yeah, that's Look all right. At how it. Mm -hmm. It tapers a little bit. I usually start. I usually start at four different points. Hey, it worked. Worked? Awesome. This thing always starts first first pull, I don't Okay, so I bumped the chalk line onto this board and then I did it with the pencil. And now we have to cut. Bye! Bye! Yay! Woo! Check one. Check one. Well, what'd you think? Of camping? Was it fun hanging out with Aaron and Rachel? Oh, of course. Always. They are camping masters, so mm -hmm. they're teaching us less experienced campers how it's done. So it's always good to have people who know what they're doing. Absolutely. Here's everybody helping set up. Say hi, Denzel. No way, no, don't get a hoot out of it. We are ready to roll.
Yeah. Huge shout out to both of our moms who helped plan and set the whole party up. Elena's dad, Mark, for doing a lot of the heavy lifting. My uncle Denzel, brother Eric, and sister-in-law Cecilia for coming to help set up. Our neighbors, Bill and Gloria, for turning their lawn into a parking lot. And our friends, Alan and Delaney, for using their truck to help get the tables and chairs. And not to forget about Cecilia's dad, Tony, our resident paparazzi. Okay, mic's on, mic check. All Is right, that thing cool. on? Okay. Yep. Should be good. I got the little quarter on too. So what do we say? You take your hat and sunglass off. So white people see your pretty face. <clears throat> well, it was a successful uh, first camping night and friend gathering, I guess, here on the property. We haven't had anyone spend the night before. Nope, we just had some people come visit for the day or just come check things out, so. I think Aaron and Rachel had a really good time. It's yeah. First time really doing any sort of framing. We built this beautiful wall that you can see behind us. We're gonna get that nailed up and stood up today. Yeah. But we thought we would cut this video uh, here just so that, <sighs> well, why are we cutting this video here? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> What do you want to say? Uh, I don't know. Elena's first night tent camping went off okay. A little bit of lack of sleep, finished the night in the truck passenger seat. So <laughs> overall, not terrible, I guess. We got until about 2.30 in the morning. <laughs> Gotta work up to it. You can't expect a girl to just sleep the whole night through. I still cannot believe it was the first time you've ever camps in your adult life in a tent that's just yeah, amazing yeah it's because i have anxiety and i don't the, the like... biggest thing was the uh the noises at night we're in the middle of the woods tall trees it's windy so there's always sticks falling around there's squirrels there's birds moving around probably some deer walking around and it sometimes sounds like they're right outside their tent outside the tent even though they're like you know 50 yards away but that had little elena on edge <laughs> this was me Literally. In the middle of the night, oh Alex, I'm so scared. Literally, <laughs> and so then at some point life. I was like, okay, I gotta cut this off. Alex needs to sleep. He's the project manager. He needs to be able to guide everyone in the morning. He needs some actual sleep. So I'm gonna go into the truck, and I felt better when I was in the truck. Even though it was really uncomfortable, it was a little bit better. And despite not having a coffee pot in the morning, we improvised and got this girl some coffee. Yep. So she is not completely dead right now. And yeah. A little bit of energy left. I have some awesome friends in my life, so that's great. Awesome. But yeah, so thanks so much to our friends, Rachel and Aaron, Shout for helping out to us. You guys. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, so they can always know that when they're walking in our house, that they built the wall that is holding up the primary structure. So. Well, part of it, the roof. Yep, I mean, it's the main load-bearing wall in the middle of the house, so anytime you're standing on that upstairs floor, Aaron and Rachel had a hand in supporting our your weight. <laughs> yeah, so anyways, thanks so much for watching, and we will see you next time. And before we really sign off, I actually have one last message, and I wrote this down because I probably was not going to remember it if I didn't, so I actually have it in my pocket right now. <laughs> I have something to talk to you about. Elena, the past six years with you have truly been the best six of my life, full of incredible memories and growth. You're my best friend, my love bug, my BB, my sweets, and about a thousand other nicknames. We have spent a countless number of hours together trying to <laughs> figuring out our path through life. We have overcome the challenges of long distance, supported each other through major life events, both good and bad, and tirelessly pursued our goals every day. I love your ambition, your commitment to lifelong learning, and your patience for my stubbornness. I love your willingness to take on new challenges and persevere through them, which is clearly evident from the project that we're standing inside right now. I love that you share a common mindset on important life topics such as loyalty to one another, handling finances, and raising children. I love your family who has made me feel like a part of it from the start of our time together. But most of all, I love you. And I would like nothing more than to spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> Elena, will you marry me? Yes. Aww. <laughs> I love you, baby. <laughs>
Mm. Catch you by surprise. I'm shaking. I'm literally shaking. Mm. <laughs> oh, I love you, baby. So sweetie. Oh my gosh. Mm. I want to spend forever with you, baby. I want to spend forever with you too. We're a team, okay? We're a team. We've conquered a lot. <laughs> We have overcome a lot of challenges, and there's still more to come, but I think together we can get it through everything, okay? Oh my God. Let's try your ring on. <laughs> I have like four hours of sleep. I'm crying, I'm crying like a maniac. Slightly hysterical. Oh my gosh. Let's try it on. Left hand. Oh my gosh. Which finger is it going? See if it still fits. Oh, perfect. Even oh in the dead of summer. God, it's so pretty. Oh. This moment will be very well documented. <laughs> As you can see, I set up a bunch of cameras around this. You probably were wondering why I was setting up so many cameras on one single spot. I didn't even notice. You didn't even notice. I was cooking the hot dog. I literally have oh my four cameras Does surrounding Rachel and this Aaron spot, know about right? this? Yes, they know. They were in on the whole thing. How were they in on it? Because we knew we had to uh, have a plan to make sure that you were going to come to the property and be there and like not like leave early or whatever and, and have a reason to film. So they left on purpose. Yeah. At noon. Yep. <sighs> mm -hmm. Why? They could have been here. <laughs> I wanted to make it special and personal and, and uh, it was just it was the plan. So. It worked oh my gosh, out. I'm like in shock. Do you like it? Do you like it, it as much so as it when you picked it out? It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh my Sweet. Let's, show, let's take a camera photo of it. Show the camera. I'm wow. shaking. Look at my hand. Look at that beauty. Oh my gosh. It's beautiful. I love it. Aww. We have a happy oh, girl. We have a happy girl. This is great. <laughs> okay, it's safe to say we are done framing. I'm gonna get the walls done. How are you gonna get walls done with a with a ring on your finger? Wait, I want to finish the wall. You what? I want to finish at least nailing the walls. How am I supposed to focus on this now, baby? I'm good. Nah. I already put half the tools away because. I knew that this was coming and I didn't really want to bother. I want to go call your parents and, and she said yes. I love her. My mother said yes. I'm so blacked out from all of that. I didn't even hear what you said. I heard it somewhere. Well, it. guess what? Sorry. It's on 4K high def video. You can watch it as many times as you want. You can watch it as many times as oh you God. want, sweetie. All right, let's pack this stuff up. Third time is a charm. Yay! He fixes it. Yeah, no. 
point did you realize that it was, it was not about a house? Whenever you were pulling a piece of paper out of your pocket, I was like, oh. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm over here like, what? Did you get like a sinking feeling or just like? I was just like, like a shaky feeling. This like is not normal. <laughs> this is not normal. It feels pretty tight, but my hands are also probably kind of small. Hug the dog too. Hug the dog, hug pal. Hug the dog. I didn't even get to see it. I 
Advice, Denzel. Come on. Come on. Any words of advice? Come on. The romantic. Work it, baby. Work it. <laughs> yeah. Have long periods of silence. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, did you get one? Not yet. Okay. I want to, everybody here, raise your glass to Elena and Alex. It was a quite a journey here today, huh? <laughs> I mean, to the point where you were we thought you were coming and then you had a battery die. Yeah. And everything. But again, I appreciate everybody coming here today. These are two really great people. They're So Well, I was supposed to make you cry, but <laughs> Yeah, was, you're crying. Make her cry. <laughs> but anyway, Again, the, this is just a special event for us. We everybody enjoyed it. We we uh, we glad you got surprised today because you had it, no idea, right, Elena? You had no idea. No, I had no clue. We uh, we this was weeks in the planning, and what? Alex this did. This was Alex's idea. Right. He wanted you to have your hallmark moment. Right. right. Was it a hallmark right. moment? <laughs> but anyway, from back from Penn State to here to your job and now your house and uh, your life together. We wish you the best. Thank you. Salute. Cheers. Cheers. Salute. Cheers. 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 Everyone, thank you so much for making it out. And, and this means an incredible amount to both of us. It was literally like three months in planning. So for those of you that came near, far, I mean, we have some six our commuters over here that that made the trip in staying at a hotel for this like oh this God. is amazing and i really really appreciate you being here for this day it's a once in a lifetime type of day so thank you so much i really thank appreciate you it tony so. <laughs> got paid so tony he doesn't get anything tony and i are your best friends <laughs> yeah. so thank you raise your glass here here the party here, goes here. on we had, no one's eaten yet, I guess. So no, we're gonna, we're gonna go awesome. get some food. We had appetizers, but we're gonna make sure we bring all down right. all the rest let's of the food. Let's get some food. Okay? Let's, let's get some drinks some flowing. Yeah. Oh my God! You guys are the stuff. best. Thank so, you. Yeah. All right. Did we do good? You did fantastic. Oh, we did good. <laughs> The rest of the evening was filled with fun, laughter, great conversation with family and friends, fantastic pulled pork barbecue from a local small business, some lawn games, and plenty of relaxation. Thanks so much to everyone who made the trip to come out and make this moment special.